Don't do it. I see where you're heading. Don't, but it the, ain't the right direction. Don't, Boy, I'm, don't I'm telling you, don't you do, do like it. like Elizabeth from Cole Lyoko. Oh, don't do it. Y'all must be twins. <laughs> I mean, I can't tell. Both of y'all heads built like kneecaps. And you ain't fooling nobody. I know you got a the second fun. job. Oh, I told you, don't right. roast you this girl. Football games she can fire you. So tell me, oh, who's going to win that? The Jets oh, or the Panthers? I say don't roast her. I say don't roast her. Oh, my God. You'll never go they can just rip parking spaces out on your porch. Oh my Man, god. I was going ballistic on Shorty Five Head. And she was 38 hot, ready light pizza. Oh my Next god. Next thing I know, everybody to the back. Oh. So goodbye to us. You have to say it, baby. Hey, YouTube. Today we're reacting to the front of the one. My boss got it back in blood. My boss got anger back at me? She, I don't want that to happen. Cause my boss got 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 got, got the hand. You probably might subscribe. Gotta put that one, two, one, two. Ain't nobody going home till I say so. Oh, Wait no way. Oh, Wait no way. I don't know about y'all, but am I the only one that's hated every single nine to five I've worked at? Not really. Like, I hate it too. I hate places. working at nine to five on the job. I hate the it block. too. Man, I got that God of War and that Crash Bandicoot. What you trying to do? I I I, I ain't seen nothing. Yeah, y'all saw something? I ain't seen nothing. Do -do. All those nine to fives had one thing in common that made me want to lock myself in the car and throw the keys out the what window. What do you mean? Head bosses. Like, bro, I honestly feel like they be giving power to the wrong people. That He's not wrong. I think when you working a nine to five job, they be giving power to the wrong, wrong people. Like, some people don't really need being power of being a boss or a manager. Like, they take literally the job too serious to a point where it be bosses that take their job to literally to a point where they will let somebody else become manager to a point where where when they not around right the manager go and be a dictator and take it way too serious so when you're a manager or boss i take this job too serious to a point where they literally will take it to a point where, man come back and do this again they're not perfect then when you do it do it the way they want it seems like it's not perfect the way they want. But they know it's gonna abuse it. Like, why are you making my day even worse than it already is? I already gotta come here. True. And the crew, money. Like, like, he already got, he already got to come here like, early in the morning at 9. And then got to leave late at sense. night. Really sometimes he don't even get, sometimes he don't even get time uh, to um, get home, home I'm early or leave early. Work. Okay, how long before you make it to work? What the f Wait, what? Okay, he in Aston. Oh, y'all are dirty bastards. You gotta find some way to get here because it's almost your time to clock in. I can't. Bro, you he in the Aston. Well, how you gonna get over. there? How many times I gotta tell you I can't make it to work? Well, you better find some way to get here or you're fired. Okay, listen here, you mother. I'm barely making it out alive and you want me to still make it to work? You stupid bitch. Oh, I ain't It needs to be the same people that do outlandish stuff just because they can. Hey, can you pull a double today? Nah, I gotta go to my auntie's funeral. Okay, so I got you down for a double. Dude, <laughs> who you think you is? You not gonna make me do nothing. You do what I tell you to do. Let's say, let's say you made an excuse and say, Oh, you gotta see your friend at the hospital. Your friend got injured and got a car accident and it wasn't your fault. But you gotta see him in the hospital. And your boss said, Oh, I, I, I. But but can you but can you do the one little little on task for me real quick before you do do so and and what and you said bro it it hurts I got I got to see see him real quick like like I'm the only friend only family guy right and you, and you, the boss said but you, you, I got this one little task to do not gonna take that long right uh, and you, you said but I got to see him right now and and you and they said but it's not gonna take that long and then then. Then when you do a task, it take it take a part like three, 
three to four hours to just complete. And you're like, bro, ain't no way I got to stay here and do all this. I, like, I'm, I'm, I'm quitting. Like, at that point, you, you might well to quit at that point. At that point, to quit. To Slave, now do the double, or you're fired. Now get back to work. Ah, son of a bitch! Back in 2016, at my very first job, about a year <laughs> in, one day, we got a new boss. We're not gonna use her real name, we're gonna call her Tara. And off the dribble, she was a pain in everybody's butt. She was overly aggressive 24-7, and if you matched her energy, she threatened to fire you. She roasted folks in the back and got super- Whoa, what? She roasted people? Get what? Fired. She never let us rest, and if you did, fired. She so you don't get no break either? And if we matched her energy, get what? Fired. But- what, what type of boy is this? this. Dude, uh, dude, like a dictator right here. Let it slide. Not only because I didn't have a backbone to stand up for myself and was too lazy to go find another job mm -hmm. if she fired me, but because of that big... That ass you with me. Golly, what a wagon she was dragging. Man, uh, I, that booty I, alone... I, hey, 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 chat. I'll tell you, tell you, tell you, tell you, what, tell you um, the story of me and, and how I got... Got Walmart and how, how suffering and how, how many times I wanted to uh, leave Walmart so bad. I'll, I'll tell you at the end. Take down the army. That thing was massive. And so was her forehead, because when she took off that hat. <laughs> oh, oh, Hannah. Golly. Shorty had the Mega Mind DLC. With the Jimmy Neutron patch update. Like, she ain't even got a forehead. She got a five head. Bruh, <laughs> you know you got a big forehead when you can put all five fingers on it and still have space left. I'm talking about everybody used to roast her forehead. But like I said before. Oh, y'all wrong, man. You know. But here's the thing. I don't feel bad for her because she what? always started it first. And oh boy. It always got bad. I remember this one time, we was about to close, right? Mm -hmm. I'm at the station cleaning. She mm -hmm. walked by and looked dead at me with my hat off and eviscerated my hairline. Golly, boy. I don't know who cut your hair, but they need to be arrested. <laughs> she, so you tell me you, whoever you cut can, your you hair, can, uh, you uh, uh, avocado. Uh, you can. I'm talking about she was going in, spamming the square, X triangle Damn it, button, everything button on the man on my hairline, bro, for no reason. I couldn't just clean my station in peace. And she thought things were sweet over here because I let her ramble on, but she ain't understand I was gonna unload the clip on that ass. So I stopped. Hey, hey, like, hey, don't do it, don't do it. I see where you're headed. Don't the bond the right don't I, I'm telling you, don't, you don't do it. Like Elizabeth from Cole Lyoko. Oh, the bond. Y'all must be twins. <laughs> I mean, I can't tell. Both y'all heads built like kneecaps. And you ain't fooling nobody. I know you got a second job. I told you don't right. roast this girl. Football games She's gonna fire you. So tell me, oh who gonna win that? The Jets oh or the Panthers? The I said the don't Jenny roast her. You. You I say don't the roast her. I don't know oh why my you're God. here. You'll never go broke. They can just rip parking spaces out on your forehead. Oh, my Man, God. I was going ballistic on Shorty Five Head. And she was 38 hot, ready like pizza. Oh, and my next God. Next thing I know, everybody to the back. Oh. <laughs> Since Devontae wants uh. to be a clown, I'm going to invite y'all to the circus. Ain't nobody going home till I say so. Oh ain't no way. Oh Hell no, man. Ain't no way. Yeah, that's right. Thank you, co-worker. See, when she said that to everybody, I knew I was the center dot on the dot board. I really wanted to be like, ugh, it ain't my fault the whole couldn't take a joke. But I ain't say nothing about what actually happened, because like I said before, I didn't have a backbone to speak my mind and was too lazy to go find another job. So I just held my tongue and just took in all the reactions. Bruh, she was so butthurt, she made all of us stay two and a half extra hours after closing oh until she approved what she thought was clean. Dude, we cleaned up areas. See, see, I, I hate, I hate, I hate when boss do this. Like, you, when you do something right and, and not the way they want, you have to stay doing that same the same task they already told you over and over until it perfect the way they want. Uh, 
and a uh, plus side, you work plus side, you gotta go back to the position that you signed up for and continue doing that position. Then Bar said, Oh, you got you got um screw up the whole uh the, the whole floor, right? And, and you strip up the whole floor and Bar said, Oh, you see, oh it, it's still not perfect. You you gotta you gotta um do it again and you like bro I I gotta do this again and, and once I finish I gotta go back and continue doing my task that I signed up for. Like uh oh, heck nah. At that point, you just you didn't want to quit at that point. That we already went over three times before. Bruh, that place looked like the future chrome crusty crab. And she still told us to clean it up over and over and over. I'm yeah, because you roasted her. Because you roasted her and, and roasted her to a point where she was 3,500 really miles. Yeah, really up. Just because that? Uh, 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 uh. Up if I had told him that she just in her feelings and couldn't take what she dished out, and now she's making us do all this. And you, you, it, it's your fault. It's your fault, Devontae. It's your fault. Herself, talking about, huh, I know where y'all ain't headed tonight. Man, Damn. When I heard that, bro. Damn. I could tell she was really happy about getting it back in blood, especially with all that abuse of power. Y'all, don't be like Tara. Learn to take what you dish out. Don't get in your feelings when you want smoke, and smoke is what you get. I've work, been working at McDonald's for a month, right? Oh, cool, working at McDonald's. They called me up. I'm happy guy I work at a store. Worked it for two, two, for, yeah, for two years and a half, right? I was happy, but during those years, I, bro, they had me working and working and working. They really had, when I came there, one car person left, right? One per car person left, cause she, she had no, it was she or he, I can't remember, had no job that she wanted to stay longer, so I took over. I worked there for my first two, first two weeks, for like three to eleven for first two weeks, and after that they gave me they gave me a ship for eight to five o'clock, eight to five thirty. Cool, cool, no, all right. Then come like and after come after that they should have kept on switching my schedule. I started working at eight thirty to five o'clock. I started working eight thirty to two, and then I, then someday I work three to eleven back to back like. Oh, hold up, wait a minute. I told her, hey, le let me just work the morning shift. I, and they let me work the morning shift. But then they realized that that they kept on switching my schedule because they had nobody working the morning shift. I had one cash register dude who, who would work helping me got fired. Then they had no register. They had a bagger who was a car person and a bagger who got fired. Then they had another car, a new, after them two, they had another car person. He got, he literally got five car person who, who was stinking, who, who was a stinking stalking, and a car person got fired. And then they had another car person, well, 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 that car, that car person actually, actually deserved to get fired. He, he really did deserve to get fired because this man would come to the car, sit there for 30, for a 30 minute break, then come back, grab like two, two big roll a car, then go back in the car, sit there for another 30 minutes, and then come back again and grab two, two big roll a car, like he been working so hard. So goodbye to us, you have to say it, baby.